Greetings, chemistry students. This shall be my last message to you this school year. At least my last video message. So this is the last time I have to use OBS and Shotcut and YouTube Studio and all that stuff. So fun for me and hopefully fun for you. So here's what we gotta do. Do your homework. Believe it or not. So this is the last week of school. Your homework is due. Do, 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 absolutely latest on Friday. But I'm putting your grades in on Friday, during the work day. Which means you need to have your stuff in before Friday. So the best, the absolute best to make sure everything gets in smooth sailing, no problem, is to turn in any missing stuff by Thursday night. It's like Thursday of midnight or whatever. That would be the smoothest and easiest way, because on Friday, when I put in your stuff, if you do your stuff right after I do it on Friday, you're going to, you know, it's going to go into zero, and you're going to have to send me an email, and I'm going to fix it, and it's going to be a headache for you, a headache for me. So, turn in all of your missing work. If you have no missing work, great. All right. Uh, when you're watching this video, your lab was due yesterday. This video comes out on Wednesday. So, your lab is already due, your little lab discussion, so that should be done. All right. So, if it's a zero M, you can do it. If it's not a zero M, you cannot do it. If you have missing homeworks, um, from before the quarantine, you should be exempted from them because if we were at school, you would have had the opportunity to make them up and it's not your fault that we're not in the building. So you're, you, those don't count against you, but anything in March, April, May, you gotta do. Um, your other classes have the same sort of due date. So it's not just chemistry, it's the other things. Now I know AP tests happened a little bit last week, a little bit this week. Um, so your AP test should be a priority here, but after AP tests, you need to get your missing work in for me and for your other teachers. So you have today, Wednesday, instead of a new homework or a new video, you have time today. Official one hour of chemistry time today, or by the time you watch this video, 55 minutes or whatever, to do your missing work. Um, you can send me an email if you need help. Um, we can set up a time to work. Please note that I am, you know, working normal teaching hours, but... Um, Noon to three for three or four days is not enough time to help all of you with your stuff. So send me an email if you need help. We can set up some time. But um, I would not on Thursday say, "Hey, I need help with eight things," because uh, I'm gonna have a bunch of people say that, and you just won't get you just won't get the help if you send me an email on Thursday, right? With ten other people asking the different stuff too. So if you have questions, get them in now. Um, if you have questions about how the grading works, how you know how what is your grade going to be, you can ask me. You can ask your counselor. Um, note that you can um, elect to select a passing grade, a P, in lieu of your A through D. So if you have at least a D minus, you can select a pass. Um, you there's more information from the assistant principal, Dr. Eric Arnold. I went to your parents about that. Um, that if you select a pass, that's fine. It doesn't count towards your GPA. Of course, you can't be on the honor roll if you have a pass for this semester um, because it, you basically your grade could have been an A to a D and no one knows. So, you know, if you have an A minus, keep your A minus. If you got a D minus, probably take the pass. Um, if you're very close, if you got a 58 or 59 percent, you just need a couple more points. Send me an email and we can figure out where you're missing a few points and get you those things. So, um, that's it for chemistry for this semester. Um, I hope to not see any of you in chemistry next year. Hopefully I'll see some of you in bioethics, though, because that'll be fun. So, I'll be in Hosky's room next year, so got to move all these books there, you know. So, um, see you in the fall, except you couple seniors, good luck. Um, that's it. Bye.